Three months ago, I had a great job and a nice apartment, and I was in love with my wife. When? Hey, hey, no, 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 no. How long? A this year. Is the first time. On our sides. I thought it was entertaining. Um, I, I thought it dealt with some family issues, some family drama, which we all deal with. Um, but I thought it was hilarious. Uh, you know, when you're dealing with Jason Bateman, you have Tina Fey, um, and they're playing brother and sister in the movie. And then you have Jane Fonda as the mom or the parent in that movie. Uh, you got some interesting characters there. Um, so I, I thought it was good. I thought it dealt with some complex issues, um, uh, but I also thought it brought uh, a good sense of family. Uh, it wrapped it all up at the end, and, and, and it talked about people spending time together, families, you know, reconnecting. I, I think we all go on with our separate lives and do different things, but when there's tra tragedy or death, uh, in this case, uh, to deal with, um, it, it kind of brings you back together. You guys are idiots, but you're my idiots. Families are sometimes going to have their their issues. Let's let's just say that. And but when a family member is dealing with something personal, you know, Jason Bateman goes through a tough time um, it, with his marriage, and his sister is there for him. You know, his sister is going through a tough time, and, and there are issues that that happen throughout your life. You know, you can depend on your family. Um, and it's just how you choose to deal with those, how you choose to look at them. And, and this film, I thought, showed a perfect way to have, you know, different attitudes, different outlooks on whatever your current situation is. And I, I thought they did a really good job of turning that into uh, not only something serious, but also a comedy. Your father had one final request, and we are going to honor it. He just wanted his kids under one roof. So for the next seven days, you are all grounded. I was not happy with if, if it was our family and this is our basketball family, then the players would be considered uh, like my kids. I, I, I had a problem with several of my kids uh, this, this past week. So I can certainly relate uh, to family issues. Uh, it makes me think of a scene in the movie where the older brother gets into a scuffle with one of, you know, one of his younger brothers. And you think about those moments where, you know, these guys are going at it, but you know they love each other. Uh, at the end of the day, they come together and, and they work things out. But it's no different than being on a team, you know. Uh, someone goes out and, and we don't get the play right, or uh, then we may have to have some conversation on the sideline about that. That doesn't mean I don't love them. It just means that we have to deal with that. Life is unpredictable and irrational. Thumbs up. I'm going to, I give it one thumbs up. One thumbs up. Just because, you know, it's one of those kind of an in-between film for the person who likes the ridiculous comedies that, you know, maybe Tina Fey and Jason Bateman are kind of known for those really over-the-top comedies. It's not that. And for the person who likes the more serious tone movies, more dramas, more intense uh, scenes, it's not necessarily that. It's kind of a blend of the two. So, uh, you know, it won't be for everybody but I think it'll be for most people. <laughs> and I want a complicated life. I'm just trying to get home.